Hello, Gemini. Mm -mm. Welcome to your bonus, you guys. So we're going to do a quick bonus here to see what's going on in your love life with you and your person, Gemini. If you guys are new here to the channel, remember to like the video if the video do resonate with you by liking the video here on YouTube. YouTube sees that you like it. Push the videos forward to a, bit, a bigger audience, okay? So the video can be successful. And then the channel is successful, okay? So it really helps when you do thumbs up the video. Also guys, go over to the Instagram, follow your girl on there. As soon as I hit 5Ks, I would definitely start these free personal readings on the Instagram, okay? And yeah, I feel like if the video doesn't resonate, I don't know if I say this, if the video doesn't resonate, there's gonna be a link in the description box, right? It's gonna be your playlist, all right? So check that out. I don't know if I said that before. All right, Gemini's. Let's see what's going on in your bonus for Gemini's, please. Oh my God, you're, listen, mommy gotta do her work. Mwah, mwah. I'll see you in a minute. <laughs> my baby is just jumping on this table. That's why I be locking the door. Gemini's. What's going on for Gemini's? One time I was um, watching one of my videos and I saw her head pop up in the video. I said, what the heck? What's going on? Gemini and their person, please. Gemini and their person. Mm, okay. All right. So somebody is definitely afraid to approach you. They de definitely want to be with you, be beside you. You feel like you're good for them, Okay. But they're afraid of something. What are you afraid of? Uh, so they did a lot. For some of you, this person scammed you, um, took a lot from you, didn't take responsibility of something that they did, um, made you cry. I feel like this person was very cold to you. This person brought, brought only dark times. This, their emotions were up and down with you. You just never knew where this person lies. And now you're like, okay, they want to be with me? This is new. This person didn't appreciate you. I feel like their karmic energy is like getting at them now. Look at this. Yeah, look at this. The tower moment is here because of what they did. Oh, so this person um broke your heart. Three of swords. Could be a third party coming through. Because you felt like this relationship was going to last. You didn't think that this person would um, do you like this. Okay, let's see. So this person is presenting them themselves to you. They want to start over from scratch with this four of pentacles. Maybe take you out, ask you for a second chance, okay? They want to tell you how much they care about you, right? But I feel like, you know, a lot of lies and stuff was hidden from this person with the seven of wands here in reverse. And they were trying to control this relationship. Maybe, you know, control you, tell you where to meet, tell you how to, you know, when y'all can see each other and stuff. There was us always in control and things just fell apart, okay? Um, what they wanted to have from you just came out in the light. I feel like after you found about it, you found out about this situation, you're just like, it's over, done with. But this person wants to give you the biggest offer they can. I feel like once this person tries to um, approach you with one offer and it doesn't work, they come again and give you a bigger offer, okay? And, you know, ooh, the Queen of Pentacles. Ah, uh, so you're confused about this. Okay, what am I seeing here? So I feel like you're going to meet someone else. But you don't know what to do. I feel like it's like a little bit too early for you. This person could be a water sign that is your ex. Um, I'm getting, it could be an air sign as well because they have air in their chart with this horrible cold way that they got about them, Gemini, Aquarius, or Libra energy. Um, they could like move on in a scratch of a dime, like act like they moved on, but they have it. I'm also getting water sign here, Scorpio, um, Cancer, Pisces energy coming through here. I feel like there's going to be somebody else that is definitely more stable coming to you, giving you when you, you gave, I feel like it's when you gave up on love though. This is what I'm hearing. Everything fell apart. You gave up on love. You're heartbroken. It could be a third party that this person brought you brought you through. Okay, you're still healing through that. And here comes a new love. 
out of the blue. Somebody that's more stable, somebody that wants a long-term committed relationship. But you're going to be confused with this because you're still thinking about your past, which is this page of wands here. It could be an Aries, Leo, Sag energy, very... um that they might lose you have a lot of anxiety very sh um, getting like a little shy out of nowhere uh, but it also could be the same person like one approach you but can't because they have a lot of they're very shy um, person but I feel like it's your ex because this this right here these ones and not only that it's like I feel like it's a lot of history with this um, page of wands here like they want to tell you something but can't. But it also could be your 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 the new person that's very shy, not very out there, but they're having like they're very developed. They're very, you know, they know what they want when they see it. I do see engagement with you and this person if that's something that you're into. Um, but I feel like you're gonna hold back, hold back on this person, okay. Like you're moving on for yourself. Like you're busy. You're trying to end this um, relationship that you just came out of. The one that definitely made you feel some kind of way. All right. And I think you're still waiting for your past in the present moment. You're still waiting for your past. You don't know if you should approach this or should give this person another chance. But you're trying to figure out what's going on. Look, the nine of ones. So you definitely want to work things out with your past, but be careful about this because I do see that you might miss an opportunity with this new person, if that's the case, okay? Because I don't see you taking the initiative and, you know, giving this person a shot, you know? So what's the conclusion with this, please? What's the conclusion with this? Yeah, look at that. You want to work things out with your history. You know, this person needs to make a decision. I feel like they will in the present moment. The Two of Pentacles. Remember I told you this person has a third party. But I feel like... This could also indicate that you need to make a decision. Because you're trying to balance out the scales here. You're trying to figure out what's good for you. I do feel like you're going to have a situation where you're going to have to make a choice between two people all right because you've been treated unfairly okay by one of them and it's making you feel like it's a burden like these relationships is maybe a relationship is not something that you want to be in but i do see you making a decision about this okay um let's see in the future so you know i feel like someone here is thinking about you missing you here they will approach you um and it's going to be the person from your past you know um, they will present themselves as being friends. There will be a conversation. You're going to be really guarded. It's going to be about these lies and betrayal, you know, that you're trying to figure out with this person. Like, okay, or you tell me the truth when you did this, when you did that. You're trying to put the pieces back together with this connection. Okay, and then you're going to make your choice from them. You might, you might stay with this person or you might just leave. It's up to you. But I do see with this nine of wands that came up twice. You know, it really indicates that you and your person wants to work things out. There's just too many history here. <sighs> that you might want to work things out with you and your person. So, even though you're burned out, you're tired, like this person put you through a lot. You're very protective over this person no matter what. This person is protective over you. You will have this person back if you had to. Um, when it comes to other people, you're still guarding this relationship. <laughs> but it's a lot to carry. It's a lot to carry because I see you struggling with this relationship. Like one more wand on my back and I swear. One more problem that come into this relationship and it's going to be, it's going to fall apart. That's what you're saying. But every time it happens, you still want to be with this person. Because you're still waiting for them. You're waiting for a message from them. You're waiting for them to show themselves. You're waiting for them to fix this. You're just shaking your head like, wow. 
this person put me through a lot. But this is what I see for you. I hope it resonates, you guys. If it does, you know what to do. Like this video. And I'll see you guys in your next one. Bye, guys.